got up this morning, turned on the light switch, and the bulb didn't come on. This is the only one I got. These are just there to fill the holes so they don't rust. But that bulb wouldn't come on. All right. So I went over there, reached for it. I can't get it. <laughs> but it's okay. I remembered I got a tool for that. This is my light bulb changer. Made it out of styrofoam. Styrofoam. Taped together. Pieces of styrofoam I had laying around. You can use, uh, like you get something you buy, comes in a box. Just cut the pieces up. Tape them together. Then, I got a styrofoam cup I taped to the end. That goes up against the bulb, but it's not enough to turn it. You need a little friction. So I took pieces of uh, fingernail file, cardboard fingernail file, and glued them in there. Three up. So now I've got a light bulb changer extension. I mean, you can buy this at a Home Depot. Or something like twenty dollars, thirty dollars. Why should I buy something like this? There's no challenge in buying it. Make something. So I'll show you how it works. Goes up against the bulb, press it in there, and turn it. Now you can, I don't know if you can see the bulb is turning out. Let's see. Come on, come on. And you see it's turning. Anyways, that's how it works. Then when I <coughs> want to put, put it in, new bulb in, put it in that cup, place it in there, turn it, and tighten it up. There it is, finished. The light bulb turner extension. Styrofoam, tape, and a cup, styrofoam cup.